Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of the Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas, I'm your host, and I'm here with... TNT Dynamite, the explosive with Jonas, I'm the man on the stage. Yep, playing Overwatch competitive rank match yes, stuff. Yes, we is. And that's what we get for us talking and waiting for the video to load and being like, oops, it's starting. Kitties. Oh, I like that skin, who is that? Which, the Brigida one? No, the black and red one. Oh, well, F you, Jonas. Don't look at other people's skins when I can't see your skin, guy. You saw my skin when I emailed Yeah, you it. look like a chode. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't know. I just want to throw that out there. You're <laughs> like, wait, what? Hey, hey, don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. They won't. Don't worry. They aren't. You're right. Oh, God. Oh, my God, Sebastian! <laughs> Dude, I really want some chicken wings today. Get them. Right, thanks, I will. <laughs> Yeah. But on Tuesdays, they're buy one, get one free. What's your favorite? I don't like chicken wings, Jonas. I love them. <laughs> <laughs> Fair. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I love that. That was good. So that, was wasn't paying attention, that was really good. I like that, I like that a lot, to be honest. Um, what's your favorite like order out food that you can't make at home? I don't know. Actually, I was thinking about ordering something now. Uh, I know. I'm it used to be too. those freaking cauliflower wings until they shanked them. Oh, dude! I I deleted. Who is I deleted. me from behind. I deleted the Postmates app off my phone because I was so disappointed at that restaurant. Wow! You deleted a whole app that had nothing to do with it. <laughs> exactly. Because I was like, I can get anything else I want from Grubhub. F Postmates. Because they the, that was their the perk. Difference? They had that one restaurant that it, no one else had. What's the difference between Grubhub and Postmates for you, though? Aren't they? They're all basically the same thing. They they don't all go to every restaurant. I mean, yeah, okay, so there's some variation there, but I mean, like. No, I, I mean it was just I had Postmates specifically because they were the only one that did that restaurant. That's freaking Lucy. And then now that that idea. restaurant jacked up their cauliflower wings, I'm like, oh, I'm good. I, I gave them like three chances too. Like, at first, I like one time, I was like, help okay. Me, help me. Then I was like, what can I do to make them better the next time? And I'm like, oh, give me some extra sauce on the side because you're skimpy on sauce. Yeah, they are skimp. They are sauce skimpers, man. I hate skimp saucers. <laughs> yeah, dude, they used to have a plethora of sauce and they were great. And then that was like, it's barely any sauce. And I'm like, dude, fried cauliflower is not good without sauce. Sorry. Hot take. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> right, you like, need so I need sauce on my on my on anything, honestly. Right, exactly. Like I'm not the naked wing guy. No, yeah. The only time I ever do naked wings is if I have something Ew. like something to dip them in. That even sounds disgusting. Oh yeah. Like, you know, some like where did I used to do that? There was oh, I know. There was a there was a place I used to go in Ohio. Mm -hmm. Actually, I don't know if I ever told you about this place. It, it was this bar in the hood of Youngstown, and the guy I worked with, I didn't. He was like, "Hey, do you want to go to this bar? They have they have cheap wings on whatever night." And I'm like, "Yeah, sure, whatever." It was in a very sketchy part of town. Never had any issues there, but it was in definitely the hood part of town. And uh, you could go in. They had 15 cent wings on Tuesdays, so you could get 30 wings for uh, wait, what was it? 15 cent times that? Wait, no, it was even cheaper than that. Whatever it was, because and they also had straw beer on draft, so you could get thirty wings and a, and a twenty-three ounce straw draft for five dollars. Oh, but the bad. wings were super small. That's why you would get like thirty because oh. they were like they were tiny wings. Where do they get these different sizes and wings? I don't man. know, but it was like that's we would always order like thirty because they were like maybe maybe like half of a normal half half as much meat on a normal wing so it was like eating like 15 wings or whatever which was still probably a lot of wings but but their sauces sucked they had <laughs> they only had barbecue i don't like tiny wings they and only bad had sauce. barbecue and hot sauce and Ew. i think it was just red hot and like a giant jug of barbecue sauce oh. so i would order them plain and i would get a side of ranch dressing and just dip them in the ranch dressing and eat just them just cisco brand yeah barbecue right just like sauce with like, like they got the five gallon bucket of barbecue and the five gallon bucket of hot sauce and just, just that a was white it. label that has barbecue sauce and like it just says bbq on it that's it <laughs> <laughs> like new Roman font. Right, exactly. But it was a great deal. We used to go, yeah, for five dollars. We would just go and hang out, and they would have, I think they had karaoke going on. Maybe it was a, D, a really bad DJ. I don't know. We went maybe like seven or eight times. It was fun. And straw beer is not the best beer. Dollar twenty-five for a uh, twenty-three ounce draft. So you, you 
take that for what it's worth. It's Straub beer? It's called Straub. S-T-R-A-U-B. Oh, Straub. Yeah. For some reason, I was thinking like strawberry flavored uh, ale, and I was uh, like, that sounds amazing. No, but that one time, remember that one time we did the podcast, and I was getting drunk, and I had that strawberry shiner? Uh, vaguely. Yeah, it was actually not bad. It was in a vaguely. tall boy can. I would try it again, but I don't even think they make it because it was so bad. <laughs> I mean, thank God. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, who wants straw beer? Straw. That's like in the same, like, that's like Odul's. No, Odul's is not alcoholic. Oh, well, it's like, uh, it's like PBR. Yeah, it's probably worse. I'm going to look up straw while we're doing this video and just uh, see, if see if it still exists. That was the second time that I booped that roadhog off the side, dude. He hates me. <laughs> Dude, I hate meat. Sometime I'm just up. a beast. That's Straub <laughs> Brewery. Looks like they're still open. Oh, they are, dude. They're still making Oh, they're ales. in PA. Straub history. Let's look at this. Oh, they have <laughs> go through the history of Straub. Yeah, dude. 21 and over. 1872. Holy Jesus. Family owned and around. fiercely independent. Mother freaking son of a bee, dude. Um, oh, it's, it's a family brewery. And that's really it. <laughs> That's it. Sorry. Well, I, I I'm glad we did the deep dive. You heard it here first. <laughs> it's from PA and it's a family. Their last name's Straub. God, that was the worst documentary I've ever been a part of. Dude, I've wa always wanted to make a documentary. Do you want to make a documentary about something? Do I want to? No. Absolutely Why not. not? I think it would be fun. Because, Jonas, uh, you know, I'm, I've, I've noticed this, like, over the years, is that you, you like to deliver knowledge and like in facts in like a funny manner, like the Colbert Report and stuff. And I respect that a hundred thousand percent. I like to just deliver like the comedy aspect of oh, it. Oh, I got you. You just and like it, to it, like chime in. And honestly, we fit together good because I mean, having a jump off point or having like a topic to talk about, especially if it's something real world that makes it interesting. Right. That makes sense, but, but, but like you would prefer to just talk about whatever. Yeah. Okay. So, no, I, I would not want to be a list of channel or a no. document. No, I don't mean like for the channel. I mean like just like put out a documentary about something. We would have to do research. Yeah, dude, I'm in. Play it a game. But we would have to do. Not winner. We would have to do research. Why do I want to do research? We should do a documentary oh. about Beulah. Uh, no. <laughs> Why do you want to learn the rich history of Beulah? <laughs> so, I don't know, dude. Put it in the mainstream. All right. That is all the time we have for today's episode. Please. Wow, it was only six minutes. Please make sure to like and subscribe. <laughs> it's a quickie for that. A-ho. <laughs> yeah, Disney. But for Jonas. TNT Dynamite. We uh, are out. out.